How you doing? Thought I'd do a real video real quick for you. Um, for some reason, this came up while I was listening to a Charlie Brown Christmas the soundtrack, <clears throat> which I love. Anyway, I'm mean, I'm getting in the spirit of it, right? So anyway, and I just thought about the first time I took a driving test at high school, where you know the teacher would get in the car and you'd be in there with two other kids. And, We'd all take turns driving around. And of course, when it came to my turn, we were heading back to the high school. And two guys in a utility truck, a county, big truck, decided they were going to screw with us. Because you could see the you know, student driver all over that thing, right? And kids. And so, and I didn't notice at first because I was just looking at the speed limit, doo -doo -doo -doo, just driving, minding my business. Both hands on the wheel. And then I look in the rear view. And these fuckers are right on my ass. I mean, and they're fucking laughing their asses off. And I'm sitting there looking in the rear view mirror. Looking in the, and I'm just, and looking at, and we're coming up to a stop sign. And these guys were not, I mean, the teacher was pissed. I could tell he was just like, what the fuck? And so he's looking at me, and he's looking at them, and he's looking at me, and he's looking at the front. He's like, and I just went went to the light. I mean, to the, it was a stop sign. I went to the stop sign. It's cool as hell. Dude. I was just like, I just, I was just pissed because they were fucking with me. So I'm like, son of a bitch. And so I slowly came up to the light. I went to the stop sign. And as soon as I, you know, stopped, looked both ways. I was being a dick too. I was like, hmm, that took off again. Because, you know, he's watching me because that's the whole point of this is my reaction. And these guys did not let off, dude. And... I just, after a while, they backed off because they realized it wasn't going to fuck with me, right? But, <laughs> but the fact that they did that, it was just, it happened. I mean, I, the other two kids were, like, freaking out because they're in the backseat looking back at these guys, right? And they're like, oh, my God, they're, you know what I mean, that kind of thing. But I saw them laughing their asses off, so I was like, okay, I see how this is, right? So I knew they were screwing with me. So, yeah, that, I just, I don't know why that came up. It was just, maybe because, you know, you're going to have people that do that to you. Christmas is not going to be a good time for everybody, I guess, I don't know. And, and if you're happy and you're you're doing your inner work and you start shining and skipping and whistling, people are going to be like, oh, this son of a bitch, right? You know what I mean? Just how people are sometimes, especially when they're down in it. Just, you know, I don't know what to tell you. Just stay in your positivity and love yourself and, you know, enjoy Christmas. I am, you know, I'm in the desert. It's kind of appropriate, you know, the whole lot of those nativity scenes were in the desert. That kind of thing. No camels or anything, but I do have little ground squirrels running around in, in crows and stuff, so that's kind of cool. Anyway. <laughs> so anyway, yeah, I just, you know, see, that's the funny thing is I'll think about, like, childhood stuff, and, and there's, you know, there's always a, like, when I actually deleted the video I was going to talk about real quick, um, when I talked about money, and my first gig was being a detective in my apartment complex. I was, like, in third grade. I was a little kid. And I just was reading Encyclopedia Brown, the the books. And I loved, you know, the little mis solved mysteries and stuff. So I thought I'd be like Encyclopedia Brown. So I had my little buddy be my um, my sidekick, my, my, my Dr. Watson, you know. And it's funny because a little girl showed up and that I knew from school. And she goes, you know, I heard you, you know, blah, blah, blah. I was like, yeah. She lost her kitten. So, you yeah. know, went looking in the parking lot and found the, the kitty under the car so I rescued it and we she gave us a dollar and then of course we didn't know how to split the dollar and that's where our friendship ended and, you know it's what it is we're little kids we didn't know what the hell to do with it right anyways but it was my dollar I was like okay I feel bad but it was like one of those things where you know what do you do rip it in half we were just children but it was funny it was my first gig too and I found the pussy cat the little kitty. Anyway, it was cute, but you know, we were little kids. He was my buddy, and I gave him some candy later or something. I don't know. We were, like I said, we we're just third grade. <clears throat> but anyways, that was my first gig, being Sherlock Holmes, and I solved the, the case, baby. Anyways, that's. Anyway, I don't know why that brought that. I deleted the video. I think that I actually talked about that. So I'm an idiot. Anyway, I'm gonna let you go. I love you, and God loves you. And the universe still digs you. And thanks for listening. Have a wonderful.